In today's video, I'm going to show you how to quickly insert rows and columns in Google Sheets Mobile. So I have my example data set right here where I just need to quickly insert some rows and columns and here's how to do it. So I'm going to start with the rows and I want to add a row in between my last expense and the total. So I'm going to do that by selecting row number seven right there. And at the bottom right corner, you'll see two tools where you can add a row at the bottom or at the top. So those are these two icons right here. If I'm going to select the first one, you'll see that it has added a row to the bottom. If I go back to row number seven again and tap on the second one, it has added a row at the top. So I want this at the bottom. So I'm going to undo that. And now I'm just going to add my additional expense, which would be for traveling. Let me go ahead and edit that. Okay. So let's add our expenses for January. Let's say it's a thousand for this one, a zero for this one, and maybe 500 for this one. And there you have it. So I'm going to format the rest later, but now I want to add another column because as you see, I'm missing the month of March. So I have January, February, and it jumped to April. Where's my March expenses? So I'm just going to quickly tap on the C column right here. Then now if we go to the bottom right corner, it's going to give us our options of where we want to add our column. So you can add it to the right of the column selected or to the left. So I want to add it to the right because this is after February. So if I tap on the first one, there you have it. We have our empty space where we can put in our March expenses. So if I tap on that and edit it, and there you have it. So that's how to quickly insert rows and columns in Google Sheets Mobile. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.